Ich freue mich Ihnen unser neues Produkt. I am pleased to present our new product, Samodix Active Bearing Technology. The Siemens Magnetic Bearing Technology for Large Machine Applications. Here in the background, you can see a rotor from a high-speed machine at a speed of 13,500 RPM and 5.5 megawatts. The rotor is held in levitation without contact in the center of the bearings on a magnetic bearing on the drive end side and a magnetic bearing on the non-drive end side. For this position, sensors in the bearings capture the position of the shaft 16,000 times per second and a controller adjusts the magnetic field of an electromagnet so that the rotor levitates exactly in the center of the bearing. And now let's take a closer look at that. The fact that the rotor floats without contact and is not held in the axial direction allows it to move easily in the axial direction. Despite the weight of 1300 kilograms, that is, the weight of a car, it can of course also be turned easily. Active magnetic bearings have the great advantage that very high circumferential speeds can be realized on the rotors and thus high revolutions, even with large rotor diameters. In conventional bearing technology, the risk of oil leakage is already rising from a circumferential speed of 80 meters per second. Therefore, we recommend the use of magnetic bearings from 80 meters per second, which enables us to put circumferential speed up to 180 meters per second into effect. Furthermore, magnetic bearings can actively damp motor vibrations. This enables us to implement integrated speed ranges from zero to maximum speed. In conventional bearing technology, there are speed exclusion windows around rotor resonances that only may be driven through quickly. In addition, active magnetic bearings are of course oil-free and maintenance-free. Active magnetic bearings are in particular used in the field of large machinery applications with large high-speed motors, compressors and turbines. As such, active magnetic bearing technology is nothing new. The special feature of the Siemens magnetic bearing technology is that we use standard components from the field of machine tool applications. Here you can see the control units that are running the controller algorithm. Down here you can see the inverter that supplies electricity to the magnetic bearing. These components are sold more than 500,000 times a year in the field of machine tools. This is a very reliable and a very proven technique. In order to make them useful for our magnetic bearing applications, we have only changed the software. A Samotion controller is superimposed to the control units. The Samotion controller carries out the human-machine interface. It monitors the operation of the magnetic bearing and implements communication with the plant control system and the Internet. Here on the screen you will see that the rotor floats exactly in the middle of the magnetic bearings. This screen displays the temperatures. Of course, our Samotion controller can be flexibly adapted to customers' needs. Another feature of the active magnetic bearings is the capability of condition monitoring. Unlike plain bearing applications, magnetic bearings not only provide information about the rotor position, but also the information on the forces which affect the rotor. Thus, a condition monitoring is possible for the machine itself and even the customer process, and our magnetic bearings are already in use. Here we see a drivetrain which is used in the Groningen gas field for gas production. The drivetrain consists of a central 23-megawatt synchronous machine that drives two compressors. The drivetrain is located in a nature reserve, which is not a problem because our magnetic bearing technology is oil-free. The continuous speed range that we can achieve with the magnetic bearings allows the customer to adjust the gas production on demand. The customer feedback on this application is extremely positive. The customer is confident in our product. I hope I was able to convince you of our product too.